Okay, we are here with uh, football coach Mike Sanford. And Mike, uh, I think the most intriguing thing to me about Tennessee Tech is obviously this QW position that uh, Watson Brown has uh, concocted for Darian Stone, who uh, played effectively against you guys last year. I don't know how much they showed it last week. I know he played it, but he didn't attempt to pass. Uh, what have you seen on film about that? Well, the first thing is I, I think it, it creates some problems. It's, it's good. It's uh, it's effective. They're both uh, both uh, Stone and the starting quarterback are in the game at the same time, and uh, they shift the quarterback out instead of having a special wildcat formation like most people do, where they leave the quarterback in but put a running back in. They just leave whatever the personnel is on the field, and he moves in from receiver. He plays. He's a starting like H receiver. They call him a W. And uh, we call him an H. Uh, and then the quarterback, the starting quarterback, moves out as a wide receiver, and they do some some quarterback run stuff with it. But we expect them to throw out of it. Yeah. How do you defend that? I mean, what, what kind of plan do you have to uh, contend with that? Well, we we uh, we practiced it this week. Obviously, uh, we had a whole uh, plan of how we how we line them up and how we play them and what we do and and uh, and how we're going to defend it. And we and. You know, obviously we're going to play the, the, the plays that they've run, but we also kind of have in our mind there's some play, plays that they haven't run that they could run, and we've we prepared ourselves for those, and we also got to be ready for, for them to pass out of it. Obviously that guy was a quarterback, so he, right. he can throw. Yeah, and some of their returning players, and Stone and Davis are among them, and, and two of their leading tacklers from last year are back. They lost some other pieces, <laughs> but uh, you know how comparable is last year's roster to this year's? For I think it's a very similar team. It's a very similar team. I think uh, this is a huge game for us. It's a home game. Uh, we 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 lost down there last year. We should have won the game. We didn't play well on special teams, uh, and and we we let them you know we let, we let them back into the game as a result of special teams and and some big plays and didn't execute on offense at the end of the game and and we've got a we've got a uh, you know we got to start fast and, and go all the way through. What's been your emphasis coming out of last week, both in a good sense and in, a, and in an improvement sense? Well, I, you know, the, 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 the positives, uh, you know, I, I think were, were the fact were the turnover thing. You know, we got to keep doing that, though. We got to we got to we got to get more turnovers and still have zero turnovers. Penalties uh, was encouraging. We got to keep doing that. You know, it's kind of like you know, it's, it's what have you done for me lately? You know, that's that's what we've got to do. Um, there's things we got to improve on. We got to improve our tackling. We've got to improve our red zone offense. Uh, we got to improve on third downs. We lost the third down battle last week, and we've got to win on third downs. We got to stop them on defense, and we got to get them off the field and on offense. We got to keep the ball and keep moving it. There's an opportunity for a few receivers this week. You guys are a little thin this week, both to injury and suspension at receiver spots. You know, talk about some of those guys getting a chance to, uh, you know, get maybe a little bit more of a, a share of the uh, of the snaps than they might have otherwise. Yeah, I think there's some guys that that have played, uh, you know, that will play. But there's a few that we're going to move around that you're going to see more of. Uh, some guys that have played on the outside that are going to play in the slot some. Um, and then I think uh, the other guy that you know because of uh, the tight end H back situation, we're going to be uh, we're going to end up with uh, uh, Isaac Beverstock. Uh, you know, we'll we'll play uh, some more, uh, and uh, Jerry Steven would be another one that'll play some more. So those guys come in as that H back. Uh, you know, in in, in when we're in a tight end H back personnel. All right, Mike. That's all I got. Thanks a lot.